Today we shape things up a little bit and talk about an experiment I recently did inspired by the awesome honey coiling experiments by Destin over its mother every day. This is a stream of shampoo dropped from about 30 cm and filmed at 400 frames per second. Nothing special is it? But wait, what is that? This crazy ejection of streams is called K effect and is today's topic. This is high speed footage of one complete cycle of the K effect from initiation to termination. Let's take a closer look. The effect starts with the ejection of a loop. This loop develops into a streamer which rises until it hits the incoming stream and the effect ends. But now to the interesting part. How does it work? On high resolution still images of the bent structure, it looks like the stream just slips off to the side and this is exactly what happens. Shampoo among only a few fluids has a special property called shear thinning. If you exert a force on such a fluid, its viscosity gets lower. So if the incoming stream hits the shampoo on the base, a very thin layer of shampoo with very low viscosity is formed on which the stream glides off to the side. This mechanism is kind of similar to the effect that allows you to skate on ice. But there's much more to the K effect and a lot of the stuff is not entirely understood or even described in the literature to this day. For example the formation of beat chains or the jumping of the band structure. Feel free to try this experiment at home, but be aware, you can easily make a mess with the shampoo as I experienced myself.